here today with the Heltrax Outfitter system. new track system is coming on the market and we're testing out today to see if this rendition is going to be what we need for this massive mountain out here in Colorado. We got the most capable vehicle here in the Midwest. Stock Jeep, a couple modifications. And I gotta say I've never seen anything like it. Sure going to a ski resort is one thing but being out here where you can't normally get to is just a surreal experience. We've got a perfectly sunny day right around freezing. A lot of wind up here the temperatures with the sun makes it really not that bad at all. Very comfortable. We've been climbing hills, up and down, going through the, the trees on and off the road. Um, you got GPS, you got your elevation, you got off-road modes. This really is a killer system we put together here. about two hours in here and uh, we just found the coolest spot for lunch. The coolest thing about this Jeep Gladiator with the Hell Tracks is you can get just about anywhere. We're on the top of this ridge overlooking what oh, has to be a five mile view of this valley below us. Cooking up some hot dogs because of the accessibility of keeping everything in the back of this truck bed. It's absolutely incredible. And the good thing about this is anyone who might not be capable of going out on a sled can still get up here and sit in the front seat and get the experience with a full heated butt warmer and defrost and, and wipers. So uh, I think the possibilities that this machine opens up are absolutely incredible. The way this Heltrax works is by having a massive surface area. Because you got this huge surface area, even though we're on top of about six feet of snow right now, some of it powder, we're not sinking in more than it's about six inches. Backcountry snowboarding in a couple feet of powder, no joke. And this board is a little small for me, but man, I'm glad I got to do it. Glad to be out here at 11,000 feet. Colorado, absolutely incredible experience and uh, glad it's accessible.
The biggest thing I'm gonna miss here is this Colorado sun. We're talking 20s at night and 55, 60 during the day. We went down to the river today and we saw a bunch of uh, trout swimming in the river. The water has to be, you know, 32 degrees. It's incredible. These trout can live all winter. It's, it's amazing to see this place in the late winter. So everything's frozen and just in, gosh, probably you know, a month and a half. This will be green with everything sprouting up. This landscape is just incredible. We go to the airport here in a little bit and we got everything put away here. Got all the machines put away. So I'm just really glad I got to come out here. Um, such a, an escape. Not too many people out here, no cell service. Really something everyone should try. Well, I've got to say, the experience of not having to go through a regular airport is absolutely incredible. We were cruising at about 600 on the way home and uh, I mean, we got back from middle of Colorado in just over two hours. Uh, I can't explain the feeling. Highly recommend it. Do well in life so you can uh, have nice things like this. Very humble.